Once again, very intense inflow up ahead of us. Back in the storm over that hill. Headed east right now to Arkansas City, trying to get back into position. And we are getting gusted at right now. This is our supercell. Explosive vertical our development. Our mesocyclone is down here with this amazing updraft tower there right above up us. Here on your left. Yeah. Right there. There's our wall cloud still. Yep, got still a wall cloud in still, in, it's still intact. Dude, you can see this thing all the way. This is amazing right now, the view we have of this. You getting that, Owen? Yes. That entire sure base, that entire thing is rotating. This it's entire convection ahead of us. This base storm has got a lot rotating. to work with. It's remaining discreet. Well, I guess we'll have six months. We're guessing it's probably going to wrap up here again. Well, now we got a classic supercell structure again. Uh, no, not yet. We need to keep going yeah. up a little bit more. Very, very broad circulation, but circulation nonetheless. Yep. And there's CGs. We're back in the inflow. Back in the inflow. Here we go. Back in the flow. Yeah, we can keep going north here. So look at that inflow there. Look at that inflow. Wow, there we go. Now you can see it on the video. Now that's good inflow right there. We got intense inflow to the storm There's again. Look at that. Look at that racing across there. Look at that. That is amazing. Do that one more time. Yeah, we have an east option. Okay, so we lost our internet like usual. I only have one bar. <laughs> but uh, we dropped south to a different cell. That was developing near what was the city we were this one was on? <laughs> yep, and we're well, taking one right in front of us, the one a little bit further to the left, further back. And we're taking a look at this baby right <laughs> here. Yep, exactly. Got a lot of lightning with this one's so we're staying in the car. So we have another tornado warning down on the Guthrie storm down here. And we are diving south as quickly as possible to hopefully get there in time for that. So that is where we are en route. That one's getting excited. Got a great cell we're trying to get on. No, the one we no 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 the one we're looking at to our right is same thing we were talking about earlier on tape. The the storm that we are actually going Just after. northwest of Stillwater look, right now. If you look at the uh, the one. It's right in front of us here. It is beautiful. Giant Mammatus. The supercell is right turning further. Um, it's about 20 minutes southwest of Stillwater. Bring you more. I got this is the supercell we are currently pursuing. <laughs> hopefully feeding it to Pawnee. Hopefully the anvil is beautiful. Look at that. The lighting and color is also amazing. Told you storms are going to intensify down south about this time of day. Took a while. Yeah, you got it right. Six, seven o'clock. So, we got to punch this baby. We're going to the forward flank. Hopefully, we don't have any hail. <coughs> we got to get down because the best supercell structure we've seen all day on radar. Um, we got a beautiful sunset going on. The sunlight's fading fast. And we do have data, so we can chase this after night if it begins to produce. So. We, uh, That's where we're headed right now. Point us out, Elk. Point us out. We are right here. We're going to drop south, hopefully beat this storm to uh, this area right here. 
Uh, we should stay outside of the hail court. We will get some rain though. All right. All right, we are now pursuing the only supercell in Oklahoma right now. Um, we beat it farther to the east, now we're gonna cut south. The cell right now, we are over here. The cell is to our southwest. We are diving south, hoping to beat that hail. Based we will on, beat that hail. Based on the latest trends, we have the storm doing even more of a right turn now. He's taking advantage of beautifully right turn photographs that we think they forecast earlier. All right, hopefully we'll get back to you once we're ahead of the storm. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Take a picture of the cop. Okay. Just did he install that like, your sheriff I'd like does to not understand the danger he's in right now. He needs to go. He's, he needs to go. he's, he's actually coming. in danger. He's driving right into this. He's driving into a train. Awesome. He must live there or something. He's oh, dude. You see? You've got to go now. <laughs> we have to go. We have to go yeah, now. It's... It's... Holy shit, this is awesome. What is it? Do you see it? No. The entire mesocyclone is like a mothership right there. It's spinning. All right, we made it out alive. We Woo! are now driving skills out front of the supercell, just east of the mezzo. Good job, Nick, for driving. Good. The uh, mezzo, we can actually see visually with the uh, backlit lightning as this mothership cloud that's just hanging there. Which Probably difficult to get on video. All right, well, we're headed back from our chase, March 23rd, 2009. We are really, really interesting day. We're not quite sure exactly what we have on video, to be completely honest. It was definitely but, a rotating wall cloud, but it may have touched the ground, in which case it would be a tornado. But according to official SPC reports, what we saw was a tornado. Yeah. But it was beautiful either way. It was beautiful either way. I will agree with you on that one, Chip. But um, it, I'm going to go back and look at some footage and actually see some other chasers' photos and stuff because I'm not really exactly sure what to call that. I, you know, I'd like to say that was a tornado. It was definitely beautiful and very intense, but I'm not quite sure yet. So we'll have to wait and see. Yeah. So we'll have to uh, do a post analysis. Yeah, whatever it was, we got some incredible footage today. Yay. Yeah.